What a treat this morning. Look who is here. Marsha Warfield made her mark as a stand-up comedian in the 1970s. Okay, then in the 80s, landed that iconic role as the no-nonsense bailiff Roz on the NBC hit sitcom Night Court. And much to fans' delight, Roz is back. She's back in the courtroom for the new version of Night Court, and she's got a big decision to make. Sorry you lost your venue. You know what, though? Big weddings are overhyped. Sarah and I actually considered eloping. I wouldn't want any witnesses if I was marrying you either. <laughs> <laughs> I think I found a great place for your wedding. It's in the heart of Manhattan. It's an historical landmark, and it has so many security cameras, you can fire your videographer. She's talking about here. I'm talking about here. <laughs> Well, considering the wedding is tomorrow, what the hell choice do I have? That's the quiet resignation I was hoping for. <laughs> and the best part is, the place comes with an officiant who's never had the honor, but suspects it's a thing they were born to do. She's talking about her. I'm talking about me! <laughs> oh, Roz! Marsha Wolf, welcome. Thank welcome. you. Welcome, you. welcome. I'm welcome. excited to be here. I'm on the Today Show, and <laughs> I'm inside. I can't, <laughs> I can't imagine anything better. Well, fans... I mean, fans who grew up watching Night Court, and including myself, were thrilled when you came back for the second season of, of the remake. You're back for the finale, which, which airs next week. It's been 30 years since you played Roz. Was it, was it easy stepping back in, into that character? It was pretty easy. I like to call it... They call it a, a, a new boot. I call it a resurrection. <laughs> and so it's, it's... I've said before, it's like... It's like going back to your prom. When you're in your 60s and 70s, it's, you never expect for it to happen, but it was probably going to be a good time. Yeah. yeah. One of the things that had to make it easier was reuniting with John Larrakin, because you guys had such a great relationship <laughs> on and off screen back then, and I'm sure it was like just getting back on a bicycle again when, when you guys got back together. Yeah, I've always said, though, riding a bike uh, is not like riding a bike, <laughs> you know, <laughs> when you're uh, in your 70s and you get on a bike. It, it's not really easy. <laughs> but uh, John is so, he's, you know, John has won all the awards. He's, he's such a great actor and he's such a nice man. You know, he has this crusty exterior, but uh, down deep, he's a sweetheart and uh, it's very easy to work with him. As we saw in that clip there, Ross is getting married yes. in next week's uh, season finale. So, I mean, what was it like for you to see this happy ending for her? It's, it's something you never could think of. Roz is getting married to a woman. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, and that is not the focus of the show. You know, the focus of the show is that she's getting married and she's happy and she needs a wedding uh, venue. It's not, oh, she's married a woman. That's the What's line. the crisis? Right. Yeah. And I think that uh, coming to that point, that we're at that point now, is really, really refreshing and nice yes, for is. me. Mm -hmm. uh, by the way, little birdie told us Roz is not the only one uh, who got married recently. Congratulations. Thank Her you very much. Tied the knot this summer out in Vegas. Yes, I did. My C wife, uh, Angie. Is Angie, uh, is Angie here? <laughs> yes. There's <she> Angie. Is. <laughs> Congratulations, Angie. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> what was the highlight from the big day, Marsha? Uh, we just decided uh, we were going to do it that day. <laughs> we we had been uh, we're going to marry today, yeah, and then we wouldn't do it. And then finally, look, we're either going to get married or we're not. Aww. And so we went and um, went down to did the whole Vegas way and mm -hmm. went to the chapel and the, uh, you know and. That's, that's did Elvis impersonators? No, no, no. <laughs> I wanted to do the drive-through thing. <laughs> where you just drive through and, you and get say, out the car. you're married, and, and, but Angie wasn't having Good that. Good for you, Angie. Yeah. Good for you. Uh, and also, another big milestone. Uh, you just celebrated a, a, a milestone birthday. Yes, I turned 70. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. I can't either. I, when I realized I was 70, I had to go lay down. <laughs> <laughs> it made me tired. Uh -huh. but, uh, well, I, I'm getting ready to hit that that number. What, what, what's your advice now that you've already passed the, the, the that point? My advice is not to grow old gracefully, grow old bodaciously. Yes, oh, hey. you know, I like keep that. Living, living doesn't stop. We think that retirement means slowing down. It just means now you have time to follow those dreams you didn't have time oh. to do before, and that's what I'm trying to do. Just go out with 
guns blazing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. I love that. And I, you know, after Night Court originally ended, you you kind of took a break from the business for about 20 years or so. But I here you, here you are now, getting back into acting. You're on the new boot. You know, you're doing stand up again. How has that all changed you? Well, you know, um, most people don't get a chance to to have success once, yeah. you know, to have real success. And I had a really good run. Mm -hmm. uh, and then life does what life yep. does, and I had to take some time off. And now I have a chance to to have be successful again. I can't be... Uh, uh, more grateful and, and uh, happy Wonderful. about the way things are going than I am. Well, that's that's terrific. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you for stopping by. Thank you. Such a treat. Me. By the way, you can catch the season two finale of Night Court next Tuesday right here on NBC. And of course, you can also stream it on Peacock. Another reason why we love our job. This is so great. <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.